Kaltumu hospitals shut due to ongoing fighting. Kaltumu's hospitals have been tr thrown into chores by the explosion of violence between the Sudanese top two top generals. People have been unable to leave their homes since that day as the two sides engaged in gun battles and bombarded each other with artillery and airstrikes. More than 185 people have been killed and are over 1,800 wounded since the fighting erupted according to United Nations figures. At the Ahmed Kassim Children's Hospital, medical staff had to evacuate all cases except the ones in the intensive care unit. Surprise while running raw with doctors, nurses, patients and their relatives trapped inside for days as the Sudanese capital turned into a war zone. There is shortage in staff medicine and oxygen the hospital is witnessing a shortage in many things and even the doctors have left said dr mohammed al mustafa there are some 20 hospitals in the capital and the neighboring city of omdaman those that still manage to operate were understaffed and overwhelmed running low on surprise and struggling with power or water cuts doctors said the sudden outbreak of fighting caught everyone off guard trapping doctors and nurses inside hospitals and preventing other staff from reaching uh, the facilities the world health organization said Many hospitals in Khartoum reported shortages of blood transfusion equipment, intravenous fluids, medical supplies, and other life-saving commodities. Along with Ahmed Kassim Children's Hospital, the Al Shab Teaching uh, Hospital shut down Monday after a word was struck in. Fighting said the general manager, Al Naim Gibril Ibrahim. Thank you so much for watching. And don't forget to subscribe for more updates.